Good morning. Yesterday I took off on the bike for some motorcycle camping and um, dad wanted to meet up at a, a campground. So um, we, we met up at a campground, we were looking at the campsites and they were just kind of depressing. Uh, it's kind of like a um, camping parking lot, camping suburbia, where everything is right next to each other. You really have no privacy. And uh, We tried um, two different campgrounds. I rode over 100 miles, and uh, we actually ended up coming back and camping on our own property in one of our own private spots. So, but, you know, you really can't beat it. We're out here by ourselves. It's free. Um, we just wanted to try something different since we, you know, we camp on our land a lot. But, just haven't found anything that can compete with it. <clears throat> so now I'm making breakfast. Um, Dad just ran back to the house to get some water so we can make some coffee. And, uh, yeah, this is the first time I've ever gone motorcycle and tractor camping. Maybe that's the thing, I don't know. Maybe my dad's going to start a new fad. John Deere mower tractor camping. Whenever I go motorcycle camping, I try to go as minimal and as light as I can. Um, this is my um, my food that I was going to be bringing with me. Uh, I got um, spaghetti and meatballs, a dry mountain house meal. And then for breakfast I was just going to do um, strawberry granola crunch. You just add hot water to it. And then, you know, I got a pretty, pretty standard setup. Stanley cooking pot. And then a MSR pocket rocket stove. And then inside I've got a GSI cup with a um, sleeve for uh, you know some hot coffee or something so meeting up with somebody you know other than getting the benefit of company uh, it's kind of nice when they bring you know a nice setup like this bacon and eggs and all the uh, high-end living supplies look at that farm fresh eggs these were laid the day before yesterday maybe the day before that Thanks for watching the video. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. And uh, until next time.